Hello, so. friends. Oh. Try it again. Three, you start. Fail. Three, oh, you start. Three, two, one. Don't, don't cut this. Okay, no. Don't leave leave the countdown in. Cut you that, though. You start. Now resume. Go. Hello, friends. Welcome to Rift Tracks. Today we are talking about, in honor of the new movie, The Hobbit. The Hobbit, yes. It is coming out soon in theaters near you. Um, we have riffs of all of the Lord of the Rings films. These are, of course, the sequels to The Hobbit. Right. Yes. Uh, uh, Paul Jackson, I believe, made them. Paul, P- Peter, Peter Paulson? Yes. 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 You might have heard of them. You might have seen them. And uh, we had a delightful time doing all 11 hours uh, of these films and riffing them. It was a great time. And you yeah. guys have fond memories of any particular scenes? It's called uh, Star Wars, right? <laughs> Lord of the Rings. Oh, right. well, I I'm think in the ballpark. Yeah. Close. My favorite thing was uh, we did a, a really funny parody song for Gone Very Gone. Yes. And, uh, and who is Gone Very Gone? Asks the casual viewer. He was sort of like a bushman, right? He was just a um, is he in a the jungle movie? Guy. He's not in the movie. All right. <laughs> yeah. Then why are we writing songs about him? <laughs> we were sort of. It was our. Um, um, him, the fact that he wasn't in the film, uh, we were very sad about that, and so we wrote a song for him, to the tune of Gone, <laughs> Daddy Gone. Your time is up. You've explained it adequately. Damn. Let us move on. Good, good. Um, what is your favorite part, Mike? Um, of I anything. Like... <laughs> I liked life. <laughs> yeah, I liked when my baby brother was born. <laughs> oh, you oh, mean yeah. like in... We did a great riff of that. In the riff. That it we was... In the riff. We went pretty right. blue with the riff of that. Oh, oh. The crowning Ooh. jokes, let yeah. me tell you. Ooh. And it was your mom. Wow. We're getting off track again, gentlemen. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> he died in birth. <laughs> oh, no, stop it. I know. We probably shouldn't have made jokes about Sorry. that. It was fun. All right, go well, ahead. Uh, Anyways, favorite horrible, scene, horrible. Lord of the Rings rips. Oh, right, yes. Um, I liked anything with the, the dwarf. Wasn't he a dwarf? He had a beard, I remember. Yeah. Yeah. Gimli. And he, he dug into stuff and tried to get gold. I think that was Gollum. I'm not sure. We know nothing of the uh, of the, of the subjects we rip. Apparently, no. Um, I think my favorite part, honestly, of the whole series is the fact that they they make that. What are, what are the? Uh, they're not orcs, but they're the things that Sauron hatches from those placentas in his. Uh, oh, that he made his, from iron. Yeah, he smelted iron. He smelted iron, and, and they dig them out of the earth. They're the big guys. Urukai. 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 My favorite part is actually the fact that they make a big. You know, build up to the fact that they're, these aren't just orcs anymore. Oh, this no. isn't some mindless rabble of orcs. They can travel all day. Yeah. They will kick they your ass. They will just yeah. they go at And then when they actually start daylight. battling them on Helm's Deep, it's just like Gimli goes, boom, 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 and yeah. Urukai are falling all over the place. Dropping so like that, dominoes. Yes. Saruman's watching on his big screen going, I, I <laughs> built them up a little, maybe a little too much. Left maybe. them in the placenta too long, the earth placenta. <laughs> As good uh, as I, thought. I very much enjoyed Brad Dourif, pretty much in anything he does, but in I, this film, because he is, as always, uh, always has a cold sweat, clammy, waxy. I like that in any actor. Horse tooth. And creepy. then he goes on film. <laughs> right. and, then... It's, and then he puts on his makeup, and he's <laughs> exactly the same. He, uh, he actually is Jodie Foster doing a character. Have you ever he does, seen him side by side? He's very foster Check it out. You do uh, not like moist actors or actresses. <laughs> this is a point that we've learned. Well, about it Bill depends on the thing. context. But yes, no. Bill has a thing about context. the word moist. No, sir. Put it back in the dictionary and no. keep it there. Yeah. But, the, but there are moist actors in Brad Dourif. I'm not talking about this anymore. Okay. Um, Lord of the Rings, I think we can agree that the three of us actually like the series pretty Love much. It. I watched it obsessively. I like it a lot. Well, yes. Obsessively being, I've seen it All three right. or four Back times. off. Yes. Then. <laughs> <laughs> but I like it a lot. It's a, it's a good movie. I As do I. I mean, there are some, there, there's some, you know, unintentionally funny moments and yeah. silly stuff and maybe not the greatest CGI here and there. Yeah. But for the most part, I am a real fan of this series, Big fan. which is... You know, something to know about Rift Tracks is not, we're not always doing stuff we think is dookie. We have yes, hearts. Although that often is that is the case, but not always. We love things and we have hearts. These guys have hearts. Yes. I don't. 
I have to say, I, I kind of got into it sideways because I had a mithril teapot, and I was ah, like, yeah. I wonder where this comes from. And then I learned it was from the dwarf <laughs> right. world, and then I got into the Lord of the Rings. I oh, had a ring of invisibility, and I, you know, the, the all-seeing eye was always bothering me. So I thought, what is this about? Sweeping across you day by day. Right. Like, I'm just trying to go to work at the salad yeah. bar. And Pretty I'm, soon I'm eating a fish in a cave. The magic <laughs> happened for me. That. Magic happened for me when I tried to cut down an ant in my backyard, and it Killed yeah. my dog. I think you remember that. <laughs> and that yeah. prompts you to read. You, you dive to Wiki and you go right. like, oh, that's, I shouldn't have done that. And so, then yeah. killed my dog. And, and he was justified. Right. Kill the him. point is, I think. Kill Kevin's dog. <laughs> it's always justified. That is the point. And there is a sub point to that. And Just, that is, if you're going to watch The Hobbit, go watch our Lord of the Rings riffs first. Yeah. And then make a mithril teapot and kill your dog. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin's dog. Thank you very much. Enjoy uh, The Hobbit if you see it in theaters. And uh, please do consider our Lord of the Ring trilogy uh, for Rift Tracks. We, we spent roughly um, 17, hours. 17 years of our lives yes. making them. And Dross, so, by the way. And Dross. And Dross. Enjoy. Tree pee pee. <laughs>